despite my um, obvious bias. I mean, my clear bias <laughs> my towards, clear bias, I'm towards the up. Vegas region. We got to really just shout out to all of the players that have joined us here today. Uh, I can't say it enough. Thank you guys so much for giving us the opportunity. If you guys are liking the commentary, if you guys are liking what you guys are seeing, you can follow myself at Iperion95 on Twitter. Oh, is it time for the plug? Yeah, it's you can follow Turtle. Plug. If you like the commentary, and if you like memes, Pokemon if you like Pokemon. memes, if you're a fan of memes, you can follow me at Turtle SSB. And I'm not talking no, no crab memes. No, I, I make quality memes, man. The, the quality ones. I'm not lying Grade to you. Grade A quality memes. Crap, I actually forgot to post one today. I'm mad. I'm hot about that. Hey, you got to follow Turtle if you want to see what it is. Damn it. I'm going to post it right now. <laughs> I'm going to post it right now while I'm commentating. You guys, uh, tur at Turtle SSB. And speaking of Turtles, we got Pokemon Trainer on the screen. Okay, so Tuan's running the Pokemon Trainer. And I like how he switched to Ivysaur immediately as soon as he had stage control. Oh, and the my trap good. Situation. I thought that Urameshu was gone there, but that up he was just enough of a distance to get out. It's that incredible how many down airs Twan has gotten in 20 seconds of this game. Two of them, to be exact. Absolutely. And this is going to be a probably a tough matchup for Urameshi and his Meta Knight here. Oh, that was clean. I like how he didn't go for the shuttle. He went the forward air just to keep his stage control. He's so aggressive. See how he went down to cover the tether recovery from Twan off stage. This might be a very even set. Yeah, that's what you got to do when you have those multiple jumps and Urbash. He knows what he has to do to get it. And Amazing. that forward smash landing so aggressively right there. Tuan had no response because he was in he was in free fall. Yeah. It was just it was just impossible for him to do anything. Okay, using making use of the flame breath to get rid of his invincibility at the ledge there. Or not get rid of it, just add some pressure, but Charizard's very easy. Is he to gonna combo. go for it? I thought he was gonna do the tornado. I thought that he was gonna go for it as well, to be honest with you. I don't think he might have been, he might have not been able to get back to the stage, or he's just trying to play it safe here, and not oh, go for the big no. hits. No, unfortunately, I don't know. You gotta you gotta go for it. You yeah. gotta go for the gold, especially on the main stage. Okay. But what do I know? <laughs> you have to win. Okay, looking even here, Tuan. Or yeah, you're actually with the percent lead on Tuan here, and now with the, the Squirtle out. Squirtle's gonna be a little bit hard to catch, actually, as Meta Knight is very small body. Oh no, he's making use of the tornado. Great landing there. That was a great uh, withdrawal yeah. there from uh, from Tuan to not get hit by that back air. Oh my goodness, was able to get that shield out before that forward smash destroyed that second stock. Oh, he's being so aggressive every time Tuan tries to recover. And he really has to. He has to take every opportunity he can to kill Tuan as soon as possible. Or else this Charizard, this Pokemon trainer, this Ivysaur, this Squirtle, she's going to keep him in trouble. And we got to be worried. I mean, Charizard will take this stock right now, be able to get a Flare Blitz, how maybe even Up Smash. Oh my god. I'm like, how the hell did Meta Knight's get up attack hit Charizard from all the way? He was at full F tilt range. And Meta Knight's get up attack hit him. It's, it's the sword, man. The sword of destiny. He went for the trump there. He's really pulling out all the stops to try to kill Tuan, but Tuan all he would, Oh no! Oh my goodness, the that grab. does not kill him. How are these guys alive so long? It's really one hit away. His oh. shield is crying! <laughs> Please, no more. <laughs> no more, please stop. All right, there we go. Finally, that Seismic Toss taking that stock. And the immediate switch back to the Squirtle. Yeah, he's looking at for that Squirtle. Oh, oh no. It doesn't matter. Squirtle the return. Smash. <laughs> Squirtle is unable to battle. Back. He actually got cut in half. <laughs> Yo, it's like the Pokemon manga where um, Squirtle, or no, uh, I think it was Survivor actually gets cut in half in the Pokemon manga. That, that manga is vicious, bro. That, that's, some, that's some crazy. That's not PG-13. Okay, Squirtle out again, looking to do some damage on Urameshi's Meta Knight. Urameshi looking for the same. He's starting these. Oh, the ladder was almost started there. Well, uh oh, oh, uh oh, oh, oh! He was ready for the switch. Oh my God, he was almost dead off of that down air. So very close. These movements, if just a little bit to the left or a little bit to the right, a few more pixels that here and there yeah. would have been the deciding factor in all both of these stocks. Yeah, and you can see Yurimesh is doing everything in his power here to keep the pressure. Oh, he's going to do it! Is he he got it! He's he dead! He got it! He got it. Oh, my goodness. Yurimesh just barely taking it. Just over, barely. Over Tuan in that first game. And that really was so close. He almost died from getting spiked in that first... Uh, Multiple uh, times. On that last ledge situation. And then after that, he was doing everything in his power to keep the pressure on Tuan because he knows, especially as... as uh, 
Ivysaur, he has so many tools to keep him at bay, and especially edge guard. So he really had to keep the pressure on there. He was able to confirm the stock. But also, shout outs to Tuan. He was using all three of those Pokemon in, in tandem, tried to he, like and utilize he was really all good of their with all strengths. Three too. Most of the time, you can see like they're not as good with Charizard or they're not as good as Squirtle. Tuan can really make it rock with any of the Pokemon here. And that's that an impressive thing to see. It's very impressive. And he played it very well, too. Very, very impressive play there from both of these, from both these amazing players. And I really like. I mean, I am biased towards Urameshi. I do like. I do want to see him win. Uh, to sh to shout out for those uh, for the Vegas Smash reps. But seeing amazing plays and seeing amazing players come out, Tuan, I'm I'm very fairly certain that he is going to find a way to adapt and potentially take this to a game number three. Okay, here we go into game two. Urameshi taking that first game over Tuan in a very close fashion. Oh my goodness, really we got the, the juggle. But oh my God. Yo! That was a 66% juggle right there. Some great stuff there. And Tuan missing the ledge with yeah. his uppy. Allows the combo to keep on going. He's untouched right now. And he's dead! That was a zero to death combo we just saw from Yurameshi. His Meta Knight is looking impeccable here. But now it's Tuan's turn to add on some damage. The up airs are putting on so much. You know, I don't think that Tuan touched the ground after that combo started. He did not. He did not touch the ground one time. He, my mans couldn't breathe. Oh, couldn't even couldn't even Pokemon switch. Yermesh, he must have had some kind of type advantage <laughs> over water. My man did not he did not want to be hydrated there. That, that, that Squirtle's removed from play. He said, I live in the desert. Get that water out of here. Desert? What's water? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> What's that? Okay. Now making it rock with the Charizard. He's looking to use that kill power from Charizard now that Yermesh is at high percent. And you see it right there with the up smash. There Amazing we go. Coverage. After that zero to death right there, only getting 30% extra credit. Up smash out of shield is so good with Charizard. Amazing Ooh. jab at the ledge. Oh is my god, it? is he dead? No, oh. he's not. And he gets back unscathed. Yeah, he barely got hit by that flare blitz. That was a super close dodge. Nice forward air. Yurameshi is looking very good in this game too. Can you sense the bias? <laughs> can you sense the can you, bias? Can you feel the bias here? But, I mean, Tuan is getting these these little hits in, getting some damage in, a good down air keeps the game competitive. Yeah. You and know, 66% is death percent if he gets the right hit. That was a super strong opening by Yurameshi in this game, too. But now that... The, oh, hold on. Oh, Tuan, my God. Tuan, I'm trying not to be biased here. I'm trying to praise you. And Tuan, he's doing a good job of bringing it back. And even as Charizard right here, he can kill Yurameshi very early. That back air almost doing it. He didn't get the sweet hit. Oh, oh my goodness, that dimensional cape almost looked like it was going to hit. Look, he's playing very patiently. I don't think you're... Oh no! That was it right there, the why tail swipe. Because uh, Tuan was absolutely setting up for the forward tilt. I don't know why Yurameshi even tried to neutral get up. I think he jumped. He's definitely going to get hit by that one. And now we're seeing the Squirtle come out yet again from Tuan to try to get damage early on. While he's still at low percent. Great coverage from that down tilt. Catching the roll in by Yurameshi, and now adding it on with the Ivysaur, so much damage. And now we've got a, the lead for Tuan. Tuan stealing that lead, and he might be turning uh -oh. this into a game three. Uh -oh. But if he can continues this ladder, he's going to be dead. That was, that was it. Drill. Oh my goodness. Expert placement on that drill, taking the second game. Absolutely calculated. That was beautiful. That and was the, the thousand IQ plays. It really was a thousand IQ because you saw his placement where he was trying to do the ladder. He missed the ladder. He went for the down air. He had the awareness to realize that he was going to switch to Charizard. And then the drill to, oh. oh. It was it was good. That, oh. I need some some quality yeah, I to, H2O I after some. after that right there. What brand is this water? Mm. I'm not even going to show it. I don't no, I don't no, even I don't even care. No clout for this water. It, it's better than our than our normal mineral Lake Mead yeah. water <laughs> in Vegas. Hydrated right here. Man, that really took it out of me. That set Ooh, was amazing. Boy. That's the type of talent you're seeing oh, here man, at Level that, Up Expo 2019. That is the caliber of the Vegas players that we saw right there. Urameshi really just showing the the world and, and Level Up that he is a force to be reckoned with and some real great commentary uh, from, from both of us. I really do appreciate you uh, taking the time to hang Absolutely. out with me. I'm enjoying everything that we've been able to do here at level up shout outs to the players to the and commentators I, I just dropped i just dropped the meme on my twitter so hit me up at turtle ssb you want to see a fire 
mean, bro. I'm not uh, even joking. Uh,